Hello everyone, I'm Master Yenxin from Kung Fu Dog Lab. This week, I'm going to share with you a Kung Fu principle called Han Shu Ba Bei in Chinese. Okay, what Han Shu Ba Bei is, is a body posture that makes your movement even faster and powerful. Okay, what it looks like, like this. When your body is straight, it's like a natural straight. When you do the Han Shung Ba Bei, so the chest start suck in, the back will automatically up. Han Shung Ming is the chest. Suck in your chest. Ba Bei Ming is your back. It's like lead up. So your back is lead up. So Naturally, when your chest in, your back will automatically back. This is called Han Shung Ba Bei. It's pretty simple. But this movement, why is so important? Especially when you practice traditional Kung Fu. Okay. This movement, when you bend, when your Han Shung Ba Bei, chest in, back up, you feel the energy the chi will automatically squeeze down to your center of your body, which we call the dan tian, or we call it core area. Okay, so when your hand jump by basing, my body changes. So slowly move down. So this already saved energy. And you can see this posture. So when you breathe, the breeze can find the strings, <clears throat> then they can stay in the central. If your body is straight on, <sighs> it's hard to find something. The breeze can be stay. So this posture see, allows your breeze traveling up and down to stay using the central dantian area. So up, down, up, down. This is how you breathe. Transform uh, working. Uh, this one, the two. When you Han Shung Ba Bei, your muscles is already impact. Uh, so, which means your body, your movement already to start. Rather, you string and you go. So that means so it's, it's a safe a time and already in the best state in your goal. And other thing is, because of organs, the weak area is at the front. So when you do the Han Shung Ba Bei, it's here, so automatically you can see, we automatically protect our organ area. Make it up small, so you easily to protect. See, like this, ha, he, see that, it's bigger. But when you're Han Shun Ba Bei, the pose you're doing, smaller, automatically small. When your hands are, it's been protected. It's automatically small, lower. You can see the heat as well. When you can, when, you, when we're big, in, when, we, when we are bigger, so when we're moving, Slightly slower, but when we're smaller, when we move, it's more even quicker. So this movement helps the moving fast. Is this then smaller? Then you move, you protect and move by all front. So because the central already impact or working together, that make the movement different. So. When you're training traditional Kung Fu, Chinese Kung Fu, you do practice the movement. See, my chest, my body is Han Shung Ba Bei. See that? You want to do this. You see how the difference is. When you straight, you feel whole the body it's losing. Okay, no tight enough. 
That's why we use the Han Xu Babe principle in your training. This principle, Han Xu Babe, also use for daily life as well. You can see the posture, huh? When we're doing showing off, or when we were like, oh, I'm best. See that? This is the body is open. Okay. This, your energy, your chi is up in your body. So on the chest, on the mind. This is give you no space in your mind or in your attitude to learn to see the good stuff from other people because you are already too busy you know, all the cheese on your head that your mind won't have time to learn to see other things you see what I mean? say like that, you, you, you it's like very exciting you know, huh, I'm good, I'm the number one you know, huh. so you are already too exciting so during this state, you won't see the good stuff. Okay? This is like that. But when we use the Han Shu Ba Bei, it's kind of a be humble. So, having your chest in, stay your energy, your chi in the center of your body. Make your body strength, which means when you be humble, your energy, your chi is down to here, you have a more room, more space to see the good stuff from different people. Your pure, your attitude is more respectful, more peaceful. Then you can see the good stuff, the beautiful stuff, right, from different people. So that's why we need to be humble. More you be humble, more stuff you learn. More stuff you learn, you will even more humble because you will gradually know how small are we. Especially in Shaolin Kung Fu. We always say that training Kung Fu is a lifetime learning. They will never end. It's no matter you begin, no matter your master, your head master, your grand master, they always be humble and be student that you're able to learn. Always learning, always learning. Okay, so this is the movement I'm sharing with you in this week. And I hope you understand this principle and use this principle in your training. That will make your training whole different. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, welcome subscribe our channel and press the like button to support us. Have a nice day and see you in the next video. Bye bye. Push your like this.